Hey guys, welcome to another video. Josh here, and today I've got another treat for you because it is Quiver Tips episode two. That's right, episode two. And today we're going to be looking at something pretty cool. So, have you ever wondered if it was possible to merge multiple video files into a single file? Now, this could be useful for multiple things. For example, say you were out at an event and you were recording with your phone, your friends recorded some parts of the event, you recorded some parts of the event, or you ran out of battery, had to charge, and then start recording again. So you've got all these video files, in all these videos in different files, and you'd like to make them into, merge them to a single file so that you can enjoy them much more easily or you know edit them later. Now I'm going to show you how to do this without any expensive fancy software just using free software off of your Mac. And the software we're going to be using, surprisingly, is QuickTime Player, which comes free with every Mac. Okay guys, let's get into this. So the first thing we'd like to do is open your folder containing your videos. In this case, I've put all my videos that I'm interested in merging into a single folder, just because it makes it easier. Uh, and the first thing to do is to open the first video open right click and open with quicktime player be sure to open this with quicktime player uh, as i cannot guarantee that this works with other uh, media players so once you have that open in quicktime player drag the second video so select and drag the second video over the second the first video now when you drag and hover over the first video you get this timeline um, element that shows up on screen where which allows you to either put the new video in front of or after the original video so in this case i'll put it after the original video and of course we repeat the same thing for the third video where we drag it over and put it behind the second video now we have all three videos over there and of course once you're done adding as many videos as you want click done so i'm going to do that now and you can see the length of the video has changed to over 20 minutes because now it contains three videos and i can scroll through to just confirm that it has in fact uh, copied and merged over all my videos now that that looks great to me so the next step is to close the window by clicking on the red button top left which opens the dialog allowing you to save your new file so you're, you're essentially going to be exporting this new file so you can select either a smaller file size to conserve space depending on what you need or greater compatibility that is a larger video which preserves a lot more of the original quality. So in this case, I'm going to select smaller file size because I'd like this to be done as quickly as possible. Right, and then we we'll click on save. And of course it begins to save. And there you have it guys. Um, it takes quite a while because it's actually merging videos together, but um, and those were very high quality files. But in your case, it might take longer, it might take shorter. But whatever the case is, I'm sure you enjoy using this functionality for your events and you know nights out and whatever the case may be to conserve your memories into more um, well packaged. Uh, uh, containers so this I, I hope this has been helpful for you guys and as usual if you like this video give us a thumbs up if you hated it thumbs down and as usual please subscribe uh, and share this video to others who you think might find it helpful and I will see you next time till then you know what I'm gonna say be fantastic thank you for watching bye